Real quick guys, right before we get into the video, we are running a New Year's Eve sale and New Year's Day sale. This will be gone January 1st. Move and Weight 10 popping up right here. First link down below, moveandweightfishing.com on all of our merchandise, so go check it out. What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? My name is Adam Lucy, and you're watching Move and Weight Fishing. If you've never seen the channel before, we just kill a lot of fish. That's pretty much all we do here, and we show you how it's done. Today I'm with my buddy CJ, and today is a very special day. Today is Christmas, the day baby Jesus was born. And you know, we spent some nice quality time with the family this morning. It's 12 o'clock right now. But in honor of Christmas Day, me and Jay gotta go kill some fish. It's in the blood, we're fiending to do it. And uh, we got a little weather window, so we're gonna head out for a little afternoon bite, and we're taking you guys with us. Let's do it. All right, we just came out the inlet, first drop caught some sardines which is exactly the bait we're looking for today oh and i'm gonna do a nice long pitch here come on we're gonna get him ready oh wow all right so the problem we're running into right now is the bait's biting especially for the middle of the day but there's so many predators, like Benita's a big snook, to where you can't let the bait string. The predator wants to eat you instantly. So, the second you get bit, you gotta rip it up. So you're only catching two at a time if you're lucky, if you get past the predator. If you don't, bye bye to your sabiki. Oh my god, look at the deer! I'm looking at snooks from around. Chewing. No! Get him, Jay! Jay! Are you kidding me? Maybe CJ like just absolutely strung sardines. Two, yeah. three, two, three hundred of them too. Good work, Jay. Look at these beautiful selects from the CJ man himself. Oh my God, what a legend he is. What a legend that man is. I don't know who birthed him. I don't know where he came from. Very shout out to Corn Ask. Chewing me. Literally all Chewing me. All came off. Literally, I didn't lose any. Why does that gog look like a runner? Because he is. Look at those gogs. This is called a goggle eye, otherwise known as a blue runner. Pretty much the same thing. We'll take them just because Dave and Nathan get mad if I throw them back. Get back down as soon as you can. Sardines are chewing. Sardines are absolutely chewing. I can't reel. I literally cannot reel. I have Whoa, look at my top cigar! Jay! That's going on. The, they're bigger than both gods. Look, oh, Sherry Deans. Jay thinks he's some type of legend. Ooh. Those straight smokes? Look at a little petite leaf. That is a little petite. That's literally Mike's eight pound black man. We got plenty of bait. Yep. Jay Foolery. Show, show me this team. Show me the money. Good work, Jay. Yep. All right, we have plenty of bait to go fish just for an afternoon. We're only gonna have three and a half, four hours of fishing time. But look at the well. Beautiful, beautiful baits. We got goggle eyes, sardines, cigar minnows. Even got a couple vagrant speedos in there. And uh, we're gonna go drift out front, see if we can catch some fish. I'm just gonna say fish. See you guys out there. So now we're covering all columns of the water. So whether it's a dolphin on top or a, a tuna down deep, whatever it is, hopefully they'll see our baits. And now we just sit and wait. 
to wait for this rubber band to either you'll set you'll see the sardine get super nervous and pick it up and then let the fish eat or it'll just snap off and you know your bit of course but we're gonna try it out we'll let you know yeah i think so too Dude. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Jay. Jay. You tell me. <laughs> Caught more of them. Uh, you need to come down and around? Yeah, I do. giant fish did you hear that run yeah I did. dude look at him it's a it's a wahoo it's a wahoo he choked it obviously wahoo or big king only two things that this could be scoping up <laughs> did the rubber band stretch and he just dude destroyed it you sure my gopro is on Oh my God, we got that whole bite. He's, he's, he's about to come on top, dude. It has to be him. Um, should I come to the back of the boat? Rubber bands right here. Nice. That's weird. You got head shakes or anything? Nothing. Sliding straight up. Did I get sharked? I never felt any sharkery. It's a giant fish, dude. Is it heavy? Yeah. Yeah, so now he's yeah. Far. Fled was right there. Obviously not. All right, you want to drive me around? I can't do another circle around the boat. Oh, big head shake. Run it again? Yep. Is that the rubber band from the original? Uh, or the lead? From the lead. Oh my god, my don't do the You think, what do you think? You tell me you've caught more. Oh, it could be a king. It's king or wahoo. There's it's nothing else. Yeah, yeah, obviously. That, I've never had a king run like that, dude. I'm not lying. Yeah, but if it's a 30 pounder, they do. That. <sighs> yeah, but these things so on top. Like, remember freaking that guy's wahoo we caught, the little one? Alright, alright. <sighs> you should be able to get an angle on him right here, so stand up high. We need to see what this fish is. I don't know. <sighs> He's got to be. Come back here if you need to. Watch the rigs. I'll watch the speakies on here. Straight up. Look under the boat. Look under the boat. It's right there. Really? Just Wahoo or a coot or Wahoo or a. Look, it look, it's a Wahoo. It's a Wahoo. You saw it? Yeah. You're lying. I'm, it's like a 40 pounder. <laughs> I got it. Maybe lift the trolling motor up, please. Yeah, lift the. I'm gonna slide around. I'm gonna slide around the bow. He's all completely. He's rub, rubbing under the bow. So lift the trolling motor up. Thanks. Thank you. Yep. Fail? No. Imagine. It's not a can. No way it can't get that. Don't jump. It's not a sail. It's a what? What is that? 
I don't know. It's a gi giant king or a wahoo. It's huge. It's king? Looks like a king. <sighs> giant king. Is that a cuda? <sighs> Thought that was him. Why does he come up top like that? Uh, <sighs> I said, look like a cuda. It's a big kingfish. I just looked down and I felt it. Did that not fight like a wahoo? Uh, I don't know. just don't know anymore. Still a freaking 40 pounder. 35 pounder. Yeah. Oh my god, that's that's a big king. Jeez Louise. Holy crap, dude. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> thought he just pulled it right there. Don't run. Imagine if that was a 50 pound wahoo next to the boat doing this. <sighs> what would you do? Go home. We, you, you, you know we would, right? Yeah. Oh, 100%. So $200 fish. Do you know how much they are? No. Ask Mike. Hell no. I mean, this thing's a, this is a, this is a, my, like 25 pounds. what the f are you talking about? You're an idiot. He's 50 pounds. Okay. I don't know. Will you put him in the boat at least? Yeah. Let me just horse him. How is that not a wahoo? I don't know. I feel the same way. Look how big that is. Like it does. What if a wahoo just came in and started scotching next to <laughs> Uh, I thought that was a wahoo. God, he smoked the deep bait. All right, right here. I, I, I am. You want a Christmas cookie too? If we would have pulled this fish off, it would have been a wahoo. 100%. Way deep. One of those days. It's 25 pounds. Dude, are you me? 25 pounds. He's 40 pounds. Why can't you be a wahoo? Alright, I'm shaking. 100% thought that was our wahoo. Just. There's been so many wahoo caught today, the past couple weeks, and like, that's what we're out here fishing for, obviously. And, Giant king. Absolute slob. 35 pounds, 40 pounds. We wished it was a colored stripe on, but it ain't. But it's all right, we're gonna reset. Still not a bad fish to have in the boat, first fish of the day. All right, just got baits back out, so now we're gonna talk about the fish for a little. Just took some pictures with her. Giant fish. And did I think that was a wahoo? Jay's gonna go ahead and weigh it. I'm gonna go ahead and weigh it. I'm gonna okay. go ahead and weigh it. <laughs> Thirty-four. <clears throat> wow. <clears throat> thirty-eight. Yeah, we'll call him thirty-eight. Forty pounds. Twenty-five pounder. We're still out here drifting. Just set up another drift. We're gonna. Do a little bit of chunking, see if we can got some old raggedy sardines. See if we can call in any type of fish. I don't know. Nice chum trail. Get all that raggedy oil in the water and all that scent. All right, I don't know what the last clip you saw was, but we are now in the inlet. We got that one giant king fish. We caught one other little one that you guys can see and had a few other bites, but the fish was really slow for the most part. I'm actually gonna continue this video and make a second video, make it a two part video. So stay tuned and we're gonna show you guys a whole nother day of fishing. Hopefully a way better bite, but 
If you guys have not already dropped a like on the video, go ahead and do that right now. It really, really, really helps me make more videos. So drop a like, subscribe. I know it's annoying, but it really helps. Let's get back into it. All right, we're back at the house. We did not end up doing a second part segment for this video because, sad news, fractured my foot. Fractured and chipped a piece of bone off my foot playing basketball a few nights ago. So bear with us the next couple weeks on videos. Is gonna like We're still going to post as much as we can, but I'm not really mobile. I'm still going to fish, though. You know me. Um, thank you guys so much for watching the video. If you enjoyed the video, drop a like on it. Do not forget to subscribe. And uh, let me know what you guys thought. That was a giant kingfish. Really wished it was a wahoo. It wasn't. Go check out the merch, movingweightfishing.com. We'd appreciate it. And, um, yeah, that's all we got. Until next video, moving weights out.